Welcome to the Defeat the Drama podcast, where you'll learn tips, tricks, and strategies to help you gain clarity, find purpose, live boldly, and defeat the drama in leadership and life. Host Kirsten E. Ross is known to many as the drama-free queen. She is the undisputed expert of transformation. She'll move you from resigned, resentful, and overwhelmed to focused, engaged, and empowered. Welcome to the Defeat the Drama podcast. I'm Kirsten Ross, your host, and this is episode number 87. Today's episode is sponsored by Pillar Social Media. They create, manage, and grow brands on the social web. So they'll help you with all your social media needs. They do websites and lots of other cool stuff. So check them out at PillarSocialMedia.com. So drama zaps energy and steals focus. So let's defeat some drama now. Today, I want to ask you, Have you ever used the phrase, I'll be happy when? You know, too many of us spend our lives saying, I'll be happy when. You know, we're waiting for that magical thing to happen. Just fill in the blank. When I get in shape, when my kids get a little older, when I find a husband, when my business is bigger, I have more time, when I lose weight, when I have a bigger house, when I take my dream vacation, when my family stops being so dysfunctional, When my employees listen better, the list goes on and on. I may have mentioned some that you've said, or you might have a whole slew of other ones. You know, I have a teen son who spends every season of the year wishing for the next season to hurry up and get here. I mean, we kind of laugh about it. You know, if it's fall, he's saying, oh, I can't wait until the snow comes. And, you know, here in Michigan, we've had a really rough winter and he's right now saying, I just can't wait until the snow melts, until spring is here. I can get back outside and play soccer. I sometimes worry that he'll never take the time to enjoy the moment and feel gratitude for what had him excited for the winter, spring, summer, or fall to get here. And it's not just happiness that eludes us at times. You could fill in the blanks with other similar statements. I couldn't add them all to the title, I'll be happy when, because it would be way too long. But here are some other things that you might say. I'll feel successful when. I'll feel complete when. I'll feel good about myself when. I'll be fulfilled when. I'll celebrate when. I'll focus on me when. I'll have life balance when. I'll vacation when. I'll get that education when. And the problem with those statements, yes, you want to set goals. Yes, you want to be shooting for something, that next big thing, or even that next little thing. But a lot of times if we're filling our lives with I'll be fill in the blank when, we feel like a victim, we can feel discouraged, we can feel frustrated in the moment. So what is that positive, elusive emotion that you're waiting to experience? What can you focus on to get there in this moment? If you've been saying, I'll be happy when, what can make you happy now? What can make you feel successful now? How can you achieve a little life balance now? What have you achieved that should help you feel successful today? Go listen to my gratitude episode. Shift your focus in a moment to what can make you feel fulfilled, successful, and happy. Feel content and positive where you are and then set your sights on the next next adventure. It's episode number 60. So for today, it's all about encouraging you to think about what you're putting off when you, that emotion, that positive, that kind of celebration, that feeling of achievement, that you really could stop and feel that positive emotion today, right now. So I encourage you to do that. So thanks for spending time with me. If there's anything I can do to help you defeat drama in your work or life, contact me. Go to DefeatTheDrama.com, click on the podcast site, and click on Submit Your Drama Challenge. I'll provide customized solutions on a future episode. Or if you need just some personal assistance, contact me that way too. I would love to help. This is what I do. This is what I've been doing for over 10 years, helping leaders achieve, helping them defeat drama in their work and their lives. So thanks for listening. Until next time, make it a great day. <music>